Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. Some homeowners are still dealing with the aftermath of yesterday's storm when trees came crashing onto their homes. Leslie Cano's live and been with the details for us. Leslie? Yes, Lee, I'm here in Benham Road, where as you can see, tree removal services have been called to help remove that down tree from that home. All this due to yesterday's strong winds. The powerful windstorm that swept through Ben Sunday caused some major damage. My husband was in the kitchen making dinner and he heard a creak and then a very large crash. He said it sounded like a giant earthquake. Sarah Lauderdale, who lives along Quay Court in Bend, says her husband and two of her children were home when their backyard tree toppled over, piercing through the roof. Over the four and a half years of owning this house, we many times have watched this tree sway a little and got a little concerned on windy days. The tree landed between their house and the fence. You can see the roots are just massive. It truly could not have fallen in a better place. It could have fallen on a neighbor's house. It could have fallen completely into the middle of our home. Um, so best case scenario for sure. One of the branches went through the roof into their bedroom. That fell basically right above and onto the corner of our bedroom. Had this been at night and had it been maybe one foot to the right, it could have been disastrous. South of Bend in Deschutes River Woods, another down tree caused damage to this home on Galen Road. And I was just kind of in the house when I heard like a loud thunderish kind of noise. And I looked out the window and that's when I saw the trees just kind of calm down on the ground and the whole house shook, everything. A tree fell onto his neighbor's roof. Daniel Serrani said the community stepped in to help out in any way that they could. We just kind of helped clean up and off so that they could patch up like the holes on the roof. Lauderdale said the tree that fell onto the side of her house will start getting removed Tuesday. The claim has been filed. We can't stay here until they determine if it's structurally sound. Um, so we will be having to stay at a hotel at least for the next few days and who knows how much longer. The tree removal company says they might not finish removing that tree by tonight. We'll keep you updated on the situation. In Bend, Leslie Cano, News Channel 21.